Hey, what's up YouTube? Pala View from NothingWire.com and today we're talking about the brand new Intex Aqua Lion 3G. This is called Lion because Intex happened to be the owner of the Indian IPL team Gujarat Lions and this is the first of the Lion series of phones. It is an entry level phone, uh, MRP is just about 5100 uh, Indian rupees, however you will get it for much cheaper online at about 4-7 um, odd rupees. Now although it's an entry level phone but you get a proper smartphone experience and this also has some tricks up its sleeve like for example it comes with a battery of capacity 3500 mAh and then also you get 21 Indian language support. So some of these goodies and other things we'll talk about in this particular video we'll do a full unboxing for you and we'll have a first quick look at this device so let's get started and that's the very colorful box and it's not very aligned properly I see here are some of the quick specs over there you see 5 inch HD resolution IPS display 1.2 gigahertz quad core processor 8 GB ROM and 1 GB of RAM 5 MP rear and 2 MP front selfie camera Android 5.1 lollipop and also supports 3G Bluetooth blah 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 32 GB of expandable memory via uh, micro SD card slot G sensor and auto call record also is there so that goes and there you see 21 language support and 3500 mAh battery definitely the USB of the device let's go ahead and open the box now hopefully the phone's turned this way no so that's the phone we'll come back to the phone in just a bit we'll go further in and then we see the battery over here which is 35 milliampere and then we have the wall adapters you see round pin USB wall adapter and then you have your micro USB 2.0 cable I'm just gonna annihilate this plastic here those are the cables and then I'm pretty entry looking entry level looking earphones actually yeah. They will go in here, silver plated audio jack, but I don't expect very high sound quality from them. Warranty card, apps, manual. Oh, by the way, this phone comes with the official Gujarat Lion app um, so that you can get their updates and stuff. User manual, and then a TPU back cover that comes out this way. Oh, God. There. Nice texture on the back. You also get a free screen guard. Yes, so that's about the content of the box, really. So there we have the phone. Now, if only this comes in. Yep, there we go. So we have some polythene over there. Can I take this off as well as yes, I can? And very nice lead right finish on the back. Straight away, I see that gives a look and feel of a phone that's much more expensive than five thousand. Uh, it gives a phone it gives an impression of a phone that's at least i don't know 8000 maybe that's five inch screen it should be very glossy already is attracting a lot of fingerprints your 2mp camera and then some of the soft keys over there you can see uh, it's all plastic by the way uh, they try to give this nice i don't know bronze look on the right on the sides here and there's a speaker there's a mic the plastic power button volume rocker micro usb port and then the 3.5 mm jack the 5 mp camera also dual led oh my goodness i can open the back flap right from here and the back flap looks rugged dude wow that's that's a very very tough back flap and that's huge space it's it's look at the space of the battery it like takes more than half of the whole housing goodness me 3000 mAh battery and then your sim card slots and micro sd card slot it comes with two sim you see sim one sim two and then a micro sd card slot so there we go 
Overall feels great in hand. So I just switched on the phone for the first time and it directly takes you to the home page, no setting up the phone. So you can see all of these apps around here and it has index is very um, light skin on top of Android 5.1, does not go bone deep. That's the notification bar. There you go. Yeah, nothing comes up from below. Of course, if you long press the home page or home button, nothing really happens. That's the recent, long pressing recent, double pressing, same thing. So it has your usual Google Android apps plus lots and lots of third party apps plus the in-house apps like Intex service station, service, uh, whatever you can service app, Intex store and stuff. Uh, lots of bloatware, that's something I'm concerned about. Can I uninstall this? Yes, I can uninstall this. So that's okay, whatever I do not like, I'm gonna uninstall. And then we can go to settings, about phone, Android 5.1, you can see. Then let's go and check out the storage. So out of 8 GB, I have about 4.45 GB. Absolutely useless if you wanna uh, install large games. Uh, but otherwise, it's fine. So let's see, out of 1 GB, I have 5. O1 MB free so more than 50% slightly over 50% free and that's okay I would say cool yeah. it's relatively smooth but it's not absolutely feather light or feather smooth let's go and check out the camera now our focus seems to be working good So from here, panorama, camera, and a video. Take some time in the transactions. And that's the front camera. It's a 2MP camera, but I see it's quite bright actually. And it does not lag, so it's, it has to be a very good 2MP camera. It's not lag much, see? I've seen 2MP cameras quite dark. Pleasantly surprised there, my boy camera and then some of the settings over there flash settings your HDR it's great we are getting all these features in a 5000 phone a sub 5000 phone so that's guys was a first look a quick look at the Intex Aqua Lions 3G we'll come back with the full review till then please stay tuned thank you